Hey there, everybody. Thomas Wood with ValueCharts.com. It is Friday, January 15th. We're going to take a look at the NASDAQ and using the uh, MQ Momentum Trender Pro and how you use that indicator and uh, one of the advantages of it. So if you think about where you make money when the when you're trading. So where do we make money when we're in a trade? Well, we make money when the market is moving. We don't make money when it's chopping sideways, unless we're in a spread or something, but we make money when the market moves. That's where the real money is made. So one of the ways of trading this is you get a directional bias on the market. You put the MQ Momentum Trend or the MQ Trender Pro on the chart. The way this works is red is bearish, green is bullish, blue is neutral, and gold bars are trailing stops. So if we have a bearish bias like we do in the stock market, then that means we take a short every time we change to red. So we go red, go into the close yesterday, that means you go short and you hold it until we're back in green. Red to blue or red to the yellow exit bar, excuse me, trailing stop bar. So you're taking shorts every time it changes to red. And if you look at what this is doing for you is where's the money made and where you get into the trade. Where you get into the trade right as the breakout starts. Every single time getting in right as the breakout starts. So ideally, what we're trying to do with this strategy is make sure we're maximizing the amount of time we're in the market while it's moving and minimizing the amount of time we're not in the market or minimizing the amount of time we're in the market when it's chopping sideways. So we're increasing the profitability and decreasing the choppiness or losing trades. So that's all I have for you for today. Have a great weekend. I will see you on Tuesday of next week due to the holiday on Monday. And until next time, happy trading.